What up guys, in this video I'm gonna show you the main five automations that I use inside of my Go High Level SaaS business. These automations have helped me make a lot more money and saved me thousands of hours of time. And you honestly could just get away with these five automations for your entire SaaS business using High Level. If you don't know what SaaS is, it stands for Software as a Service. I have a free course down below this video. You can get access to it and it'll show you how to set up your entire software business using the high level platform. Also, if you want to get access to high level, which is the software platform that we use to start our SaaS business, there's a link down below where you can get a 14 day free trial. Please remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel so I can give you more free content like this video. All right, so we're jumping right into this first automation here. This is an automation for when a potential client books a demo with me so that I can show them the software over Zoom, show them all the different features. And so this one triggers whenever somebody books an appointment. So we set up the trigger there. The next part of this automation is we wanna update them in our pipeline. This is my pipeline right here. So I've got four different stages, new lead, appointment booked, follow-up drip, and paying client. So when somebody books that appointment, I want them to automatically move from the new lead stage to the appointment book stage so that I can kind of keep track of everybody. So that's what that automation does right there. And then the next step is an internal booking text. So this will send me a text message to my phone saying, so-and-so has booked an appointment with you on this date at this time, just to give me a heads up that they have booked that appointment. The next step is a 30 second wait step. So 30 seconds after they book this appointment on our calendar, they will receive a booking confirmation text saying, hey, John, this is Jasper. Just saw that you booked an appointment for this date at this time, and I'll send them the Zoom link, blah, blah, blah. And then I'll also send them a booking confirmation email that says basically the same message as this text, giving them the Zoom link, telling them when the appointment was booked, and so on. And then our next step is a wait until 30 minutes before appointment. So basically, we just have to put these wait steps so that everything we set up doesn't just go one after another like in one second. We want these wait steps put in place so that all of our text and emails and all these actions that we're sending out don't happen simultaneously right at the same time. So 30 minutes before the appointment starts, we have an automated text and an automated email that sends out reminding them of the appointment. It'll say something like, hey, your appointment is in 30 minutes, yada, yada, yada. Here's the Zoom link again. See you then, something like that. So that text and that email will say something along those lines. Having this reminder text and email to go out 30 minutes before the appointment is supposed to happen will significantly up your show rate, meaning the rate at which people will show up to the appointment that they booked. So it's really cool that we can just automate this and we don't have to send it out manually. And then our next step is another wait step 15 minutes before the appointment starts. And it's an internal reminder text to me. It'll go right to my phone saying, hey, Jasper, you have a call in 15 minutes. Make sure to be on your computer ready to go. So that's the entire automation here. Great way to save yourself some time and make sure people show up to those appointments that they book. Um, the next automation that I have built out is for onboarding new clients. So let's say we get to the end of my demo call. That person wants to sign up with my software here. I want to make sure that I give them all the information that they need so that they can log into their account and get everything rolling. And so I have an automation that I've built out for this. This one is triggered by a tag. So whenever I tag somebody with an onboarding tag, that's a specific tag that I've built out, basically placing a note on that person that they need to be onboarded it will automatically remove them from any other workflows that they were in previously or any other automations that they were in because we don't want to keep sending them texts or emails if they've already paid and want to sign up. And then we have an automated email that goes out giving them their login info, also a link where they can download the mobile app for the software, welcoming them to the software and so on. And then we also send an onboarding email that says basically the same thing as the text message. So this is another really good automation to build out for onboarding your clients. It all triggers off with a single place of one tag on that lead inside the system. So just makes things super easy, saves yourself a bunch of time. Another really great automation is just a follow-up in one week. So at the end of my Zoom calls, not everybody buys, I'm, I'm a decent salesman, but not everybody buys my software that day after the Zoom call. And so a lot of them I found will say, follow up with me next week. You know, I need to talk to my business partner. I need to talk to my spouse, yada, 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 whatever their objection is. And so I've got this automation built out where it triggers with a tag. So I'll place a tag on that person inside the system. It's a tag that I call the follow up in one week tag. 
and then it will automatically remove them from all other workflows. We don't want to keep hounding them and texting them in those other automations that we've built out. So it'll remove them from those. It'll wait one week. And then we have this text that sends out that says, hey, John, this is Jasper with Advanced. Just following up, you said to give you a week and I uh, just wanted to see where you're at with the software, something along those lines so that I don't have to remember, hey, I need to text John in a week because he didn't sign up or whatever. And so this is another one that just makes it really easy. All you have to do is place a single tag on that person and it'll automatically send that text to them a week later. This automation is very similar to the first automation I showed you when somebody books an appointment to schedule a demo. But this one is different because this one is for people that have already started paying or already signed up. I always have an onboarding Zoom call with all of my new clients just so I can show them the inside of the platform set up for them specifically and just really make sure that they understand how to use everything. And so this one just fires off when they book that onboarding call with me. And then it will update them in our pipeline to the paying client stage so it'll automatically move them so that they stay organized in my pipeline. And then I have an internal text message that will send to myself saying, hey, this client has booked their onboarding call so that I can show them the platform. And then it'll wait 30 seconds. And then the client will receive a booking confirmation text, a booking confirmation email. And then 30 minutes before that appointment happens so that I can onboard them fully, they will get another text, another email. And then 15 minutes before that Zoom chat it'll send me another internal text to myself saying, hey, 15 minutes from now, you've got your Zoom. Make sure you're ready in front of your computer so that you can onboard this client. Super basic automation here, but if you are running a SaaS business, I recommend doing an onboarding call with all of your new clients just so that they understand the platform. This is really good so that you don't get a bunch of questions later down the line where they're texting you and emailing you and calling you all the time. Um, needing help. So just make sure they understand the platform. And this automation here is really just a, a big time saver. As part of my SaaS business, I actually get a lot of my clients because I've built out a free course teaching them how to run Facebook ads. Really great way to get people in the door, give them something for free. And then as part of that, you want to upsell them on the software because the software will help them manage those Facebook ads that they're going to run. And so this automation is for my free course. Whenever they get access to the free course, it will put them in that certain stage in the pipeline saying that they've accessed the free course. And then it will send them a welcome text saying, hey, thanks for jumping into the free course. And then also a welcome email saying something similar, giving them their login info so that they can log back into the course after they've jumped back out of it. And so this one's really important to me because it's one of the top ways that I get clients. You can actually build out your course right inside the Go High Level Course Builder if you didn't know that. Um, that's something I didn't know for a really long time. It's kind of hidden. It's under the site tab and then under the membership tab. But yeah, pro tip to getting clients, build out a course offering some sort of value for free and then make your software and upsell. So there you have it, guys. Those are the five main automations that I use for my SaaS business. By all means, add more automations if you feel that you need them. But those are five that have saved me a ton of time and made me a lot of money in my business. If you haven't already and you want to learn how to build your own SaaS business, you can check out my free masterclass down below. It'll show you step by step on how to build everything out and how to scale to $5,000 a month passive income in just 30 days. And then also below, there's a link to a 14-day free trial to go high level if you haven't jumped in to go high level yet. Please remember to like and subscribe as it really helps out the channel and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.